What is up, everybody? This is Nomad1012. Hey, today is May 25th, uh, same day that they are releasing the Jordan 1 and the SB collaboration. And guess what, man? I managed to pick them up this morning. So let me go ahead and uh, show you guys um, the orders page right here. And there it is, man. Order confirmed. Your boy managed to complete the set right here. So we got the Air Jordan 1 Chicago, uh, LA to Chicago, and then Air Jordan 1 uh, New York to Paris. Super excited, you guys. Um, if you haven't seen the video yet, uh, I managed to pick up the Air Jordan 1 um, New York to Paris on an exclusive like uh, release. Um, it was actually like a, a sneaker cam uh, thing that the sneaker app did. And um, I flashed the, the camera on a particular photo that they were looking for. And uh, once I did that, I was able to unlock it and make the purchase. So they did that twice, actually, uh, earlier this week. The first time they did that, I didn't know what to look for. I didn't know what to do. Uh, I'd never done a sneaker cam before. Um, so, but I, I, I learned from that, right? I learned from it. And then the second time they did it, and, uh, this was all a surprise to me. Um, I was able to manage to navigate and find the picture that they're looking for. I was, I was better at it. So I think this video is all about that is, you know, my video, some of the videos I have is really to help educate and let you know and prepare you for the next release. Because sometimes, you know, it just doesn't work out the first time, but you can learn from that. So anyway, um, I got a, I had a question earlier today uh, asking, hey, so where do you, which screen do you go to to um, make your purchase? And as you can see, um, this is like the tiled view of, of the stickers app. And here you really can't make a purchase. Uh, if you change the view to this one right here, um, it lets you make a purchase from this screen or, you know, um, hit the notify. So I'm going to go ahead and, and do that right now because uh, even though I'm not really going to rock these shoes, um, I'm probably going to cop for resale. And of course, I'm a big fan of Ray Allen. So I'm going to go ahead and try to cop those. And this one right here, I'm going to try to cop these too, man, because these are fire right here. These Kobe four pro tros the black del sol man those are really good oh those are sitting right here so the lebron blacks anyway so going back to the question um where, which screen do i go to to make the purchase so as you can see if i scroll down a little bit over here and look at the previous releases um you can see um that there's like a button where you can make a purchase right here so $200 for this LeBron uh, 16 Hot Lava. Um, and by the way, man, Nike be tri tripping, man. This one, yesterday, this was showing sold out. And I was like, you know what? I think that's a lie. So I went to Foot Locker. I went to Champs.com. And they, they were, man. They were sitting ducks. They were just sitting right there waiting for anybody to purchase. And uh, on, But, but on, this, on the Nike Sneakers app... It was saying sold out. So you have to be careful with the sneakers app because they be lying to you sometimes. So anyway, um, so to the, back to the question. Um, so I think this is the best screen right here to make your purchase because most of the time, like, you know, when, when um, they release uh, a new shoe, this is going to be on, on top of the page right here. And if you have trouble um, getting to the page or like loading problems, you can always like, you know, I'm swiping down on the screen and then uh, you can always like refresh it from here if you needed to. But typically on release day, uh, the, um, <clears throat> the button that you see right here, uh, which let's see, let's see if we can find one right here as an example, like for instance, right here it says notify me this, this button will, will turn into like the price of the shoe automatically. 
So there's really no need for you to refresh. There's no need for you to go to another page. You can just sit right here and wait for it to come up. Um, alternatively, um, you can also go into the page. So if this is the only shoe that, um, that uh, you're trying to go for, you know, you can just sit right here and then wait for this button to change into that price. And by the way, I, that was a notification just, just now to let me know that um, the, what is it called? The, the Shoe Palace Jordan 1 is going to be coming out real soon in about 10 minutes. So I'll, I'll have to prepare for that. Um, so I think, I think this video, man, I think, I don't know what to call it yet, but I think this is, uh, kind of like an education video, kind of like an awareness video that, you know, if you do the due diligence and like prepare for a, a release day, um, uh, I think you'll do just fine. I think, I think you can, you can, even though if you get an L for instance, you know, don't worry about it, man. There's always going to be the next release. There's always going to be the next hype shoe coming out within the next week or the next two weeks it doesn't it doesn't really matter man like they're they're always releasing new shoes but at least you can say that you've made your attempt and then um and then you did the best you could and you, you know you use all your all the resources that you have in front of you in order to cop the shoe that you want so anyway this is all i have for today um like i said i need to uh prepare for the um the shoe that's going to be releasing at uh, Shoe Palace. Uh, if you haven't seen that one yet, it's a it's a shoe that um, has uh, that comes with a lunchbox uh, for the Jordan One. It looks pretty good, man. So anyway, uh, this is all I have for today. Talk to you guys soon.